The state of Missouri has updated some election laws since the 2020 election. The Adair County Clerk's Office has been sending flyers to all registered voters in Adair County to give them the latest updates. Two of the main changes were the redrawing of district lines and requiring a photo ID in order to cast an official ballot. Adair County has been split into two districts, District 3 and District 4. County officials will have two sets of ballots at the polling locations and they will give you the ballot that fits your district. The county clerk's office encourages everyone to update their home addresses if they've moved recently. But if you have moved, we would appreciate you getting a hold of us so we can get your address changed to make sure that you arrive at your current voting location. Photo IDs are also required to cast an official ballot now. Kirksville license office officials tell me that it usually takes 7 to 10 business days to get a new ID card. They usually cost $18, but if you're using the photo ID for voting purposes, the state of Missouri will cover the cost. However, if you cannot obtain a photo ID, polling officials won't turn you away. If they don't have any form of identification whatsoever, they can call, they can vote what is called a provisional ballot on election day. And what that will do is we will verify their signature on their voter registration card. So if you're registered, we will make sure that you can vote. If your household has one registered voter, you should have received this flyer from the Dare County Clerk in the mail. Reporting from Kirksville, Nick Todorovich, KTVO. Dare County will have 10 polling stations this election season. Election Day is November 8th, and you can cast your vote from 6 a.m. to 7 p.m.